Hello. Crystal Fowler, wake your little hiney up, girl. Good morning. It's Gary in Bristol. Good morning. It's Gary in Bristol from Kiss Country 93.7. Huh. Huh. <laughs> wake up. Wake up. It's going to be a beautiful what? day. It is. It is. Because Crystal Fowler's in it. Indeed. Crystal, do you know Michael Vaughn? Yes. <laughs> he wrote us a letter about you, and we were hoping that we could share it with you. Okay. Okay. So, now, now, I know you're asleep right now, so shake your head. Yeah, wipe the sleep yeah. out of your eyes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is really important I'm stuff, sorry. Crystal. Okay? Okay. This is worth waking okay. up for. And it's not a dream. This is okay. actually happening. Okay. He says Crystal's I'm awake. <laughs> he says Crystal... <laughs> Crystal's one of the nicest and most kind-hearted individuals I know. She will go above and beyond expectations to help a family member, friend, or even someone she doesn't even know. Recently, she was diagnosed with breast cancer, and now she is cancer-free. But through it all, she never got down and beat it like a champ. Now she takes calls from people mm-hmm. who have been diagnosed with breast cancer and talks to them about her experience and helps to ease their fears. She also works as an RN for a home health care company and goes to see many patients. I've seen her go after work hours back to a patient's house and carry food that she went and bought to them so they would have something to eat. And just recently on Thanksgiving, I know she left her family's Thanksgiving dinner with a couple of extra plates of food and carried them to a patient because she knew they didn't have any family and didn't have any food to eat for Thanksgiving. This is why I think Crystal should be this week's Kiss Country Caught in the Act Award recipient because she has a heart of gold and loves doing what she does. Oh, I'm speechless. Wow. Wow. And that's your cousin. That's That's my cousin. He's more like a brother to me, but yes, he's, he's always, he's, um, 10 years older than me. He actually just had a birthday. And turned fifty. So. <laughs> so, did you have any idea? Did you have any, Did you have any? No. Idea that you know that he was in awe of you. Did you know that? That he, you know he sits no. back and watches Crystal and is amazed at her heart. No, I had no idea. Um, no, that is so sweet. Like I had no idea. Well, Crystal, because like, I look up to him like so much, and I didn't realize that. He I is guess so he proud of you. Thing. Mm-hmm. He is so That's proud. So sweet. Well, you are this week's recipient of the Kiss Country Caught in the Act Award. And not only are we going to brag about you on the radio and our YouTube channel and our Facebook page and our website and the app, but on top of that, you get a $100 gift card to go to Silver Star oh, and have wow. a great... Yeah! Yeah, now it's getting good. Now oh, you're awake. That's huh? good. Yeah, now it's good. That's right. I'm well, the now. idea <laughs> of steak and all grottens will wake up any girl in Louisiana. <laughs> that's right. Can, can you smell it yet? Yes, yeah. I'm ready. <laughs> Is it dinner time? I was going to say, yeah, you yeah. open the door at Silver Star uh, to get out of your car in the parking lot, and you're just like, oh. Yes. It's like St. Peter just so opened good. the gates. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Chris, right. Crystal, thank you. You know, not only for letting us wake yeah. you up this way, but thank you for being so awesome and, and making this an incredible place to live. Oh, well, thank you. I just feel like it's, you know, it's definitely a calling, and I love what I do, so. I've been blessed for sure. You know, um, yesterday morning, Bristol found these quotes. We've got them on our website. And one of them was, um, success in life is not what you have, but what you gave away. Mm -hmm. And I I think you're probably one of the most successful people we will ever talk to. Oh, well, thank you. Well, honestly, Uh, I do love. Go ahead. Oh, no, I was just going to say, you know, it's easy sometimes to write a check for sure. But when you give of your time, you're giving, right. I mean, that you are giving of yourself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Most definitely. Um, I just love, I mean, I do, I love helping other people. And it just, it brings me, you know, I just love it. I don't, I can't explain it. It's just something, I guess I was you know like i said it's a calling for sure and then you know with a breast cancer it's like you get a kind of get a wake-up call that life's so so short and that's you know you gotta do what you're here i feel like i'm doing what i'm here to do 